welcome to the Logic Minute. In this installment, I'm going to demonstrate how you can import and set up a video for your given projects. So first things first, let's open up our video and then we'll worry about synchronizing it with uh, the rest of the project here. So let's go up to options and you'll see there's a movie choice on the menu here and from here we can choose to open movie and it should open you to uh, your movies folder by default which is where I have the one I'm looking for so let's go ahead and open it up and once we've inserted a movie you'll notice that we do have a little movie window that pops up over here that wasn't there before so if you turn that down it will uh, play the movie back in the top left here you'll see as I play back it starts to play here now if I close this uh, the movie will actually go offline so if you do need to do some work without the movie playing if it's causing uh, glitches or something you can turn it off that way I can open it up large again by double clicking on that and opens up into a separate window uh, you can even set up a separate monitor to handle uh, your your film if you have uh, a device that will allow you to sync to an external monitor and also we can view the video and the frames in the global tracks it automatically uh, creates a video global track for us when we import a film so you can get a kind of thumbnail view of this the various images through the video here and one last thing let's open up our settings menu and go to video you'll see here that you have a place to indicate the SMPTE time code of the movie start so this is really really important if you're going to be actually syncing up to film that has a SMPTE time code printed on it you would want to make sure that uh, the movie start point is entered appropriately here based on the time code that you have and another important thing to know about is the synchronization if you go to synchronization you can also set here which bar position in our logic arrange window in the project will correspond to uh, a given SMPTE time code frame so uh, that is the way you would set a video offset so if I wanted say uh, if I wanted my music at bar one beat one to start part way through my video let's say at about five seconds in you could do that simply by entering that part here and you'll see that bar one now becomes five seconds into my video and those are the basics of importing and setting up video in Logic Pro 8. If you want to master Logic Studio fast, drop what you're doing now and head to logicstudiotraining.com.